This one is from Erica. My husband and I currently share custody alternate weeks of our 16 year old son. Recently, he's been saying that he does not want to spend time at his dad's house anymore. How old does he have to be before he can decide for himself? That's a pretty good question. It's a great question and it does happen particularly when children get to the teenage span where they want to, shall we say, control themselves more and <laughs> have mom and dad control less. Uh, children cannot make the decision legally as to where they feel like they want to be. A lot of times when kids get into 15, 16, 17, they s try to assert themselves and say, well, I just want to live with dad or I just want to live with mom. The parents have to be parents. The parents have to be the one to set the rules. The parents have to be parents even though they're not still married. And the best thing to do is for the parents to act like adults, make adult decisions for the best interest of that child. Because that best interest of that child is what the judge is gonna use as a barometer to change anything. There are procedures for modification of final marital settlement agreements. You may or may not qualify for those modifications. And just because the child gets 16 and says, well, I got a driver's license now, I want to live with that one, not necessarily so is that the way it's going to be. Because the law says the parents are the parents, and until that child is at 18 or finishes high school before or during his 19th year, the child support goes away obligations after that. Do parents just abandon their children at 18 or 19? Let's hope not. No. <laughs> Do they? And usually what happens is one parent is more financially qualified than the other, and usually that is the parent that bears the brunt of the financial responsibilities if they help the child pass high school. But all the state of Florida really requires is that the child be supported financially by both parties, both parents, whether they're married or not, whether they're cooperative or not, they still have the obligation because they created that child. It's their job to get that child at least through high school and at least at the age of 18. So, 